los arenales regada en sangre del bravosa y um, I'm sitting here with my colleagues Thomas H and Vincent H. <laughs> oh, Vincent B. And it's it's early, and we're here on uh, Via Palermo, number ten, for the show of Iceberg. Today's time. Today's call time is a good question. Too, too early, really. Yeah, it was really early. Seven thirty, but. And what have you been doing last night then, that it was too early? Oh, well, we had an agency dinner with uh, my agent from Belgium called Yves Catalan, really good guy. And uh, my agent from London called Chris from Premier. All right, really interesting, really interesting. And what was your plan last night? I had the same thing going on with Thomas. Oh, you yeah. You guys have the same agency in... In Belgium. <laughs> Any plans for later on the night? You go out or want to see Milan? No, I'm not going out. I think I'm just gonna take the green line home. Green line home to what metro stop for maybe some girls who want to know? <laughs> okay, that's 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 enough. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thanks a lot. I'm Janice for Fashion TV. Restaurant Critty. Oyster bike. See you later. Bye bye. Que vuelve crecida de un sueño verde My name is Vladimir. Vladimir, it's a great name. What's, uh, what agency are you with? I'm out here in Milan. I'm with Elite. Elite? Mm -hmm. Alright, great. And um, uh, how's Milan treating you this season? Um, it's pretty good. I mean, it's, it's been a pretty busy season. I'm feeling pretty good. It's the last day of show, so uh, feeling pretty awesome. Cause, but we still got Paris to go, so um, but Milan's finally over. Today's the last day. So feeling good. You ready for the show? Not really. No. Nah. What do you got to do to get ready for the show? Um, a lot of sleep. <laughs> well, you got a couple. You may have one more hour to get some sleep in. So, what's your name? Jonathan Marquez. Where are you from? I'm from Los Angeles, Venice Beach, to be exact. Ooh. Yeah. How is Venice Beach? Venice Beach, uh, you know, I haven't been there in a long time, but I'm sure the weather's really hot and warm right now. I wish I was there. <laughs> I wish I was there too right now. <laughs> so how long have you been modeling? I've only been modeling for two years. Two years. That's two it. Years? Two solid that's, years. That's, that's, that's enough just to be out there and know everything. Um, yeah. So how do you feel about the fashion industry? I feel great about the fashion industry, you know, it's been treating me kind of good, you know, meeting people like you, you know, good, good guys, good designers, and uh, working these great shows with a bunch of people around me. Are you excited that Fashion Week is finally almost over? I am, in a sense, just uh, there's another Fashion Week coming up in Paris, so there's no, no real break. But uh, Milan was great, and um, hopefully I'll be back for summer. The inspiration is um, is uh, strongly related to the knitwear. Uh, knitwear for us it's uh, very important and so we 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 did uh, all in knitwear from pants to jacket and coats um, in a tailored tailored uh, way the music is uh, it's about uh, argentinian folk 
So it's very Latino kind of thing. I'm, I'm from Argentina, so it was very easy for me to find like the right track. So we, we opened the show with, uh, with this very, very traditional song from uh, Jose Larralde, which is a very famous um, Argentinian singer. And uh, especially this version is like a very deep, uh, like a new remix from, from one old song. I'm working on my own blog, which is MarceloBurlonBlog.com, um, which is a properly web magazine, and uh, that's you know that's the one. And all my parties, all the events that I'm organizing, I love fashion TV.